So tell us about what being a member of the Fine Arts Center means to you. What, what have you enjoyed? And what I've really enjoyed about it, most of what I've enjoyed about it, is what it's done for my grandson Michael here, the teacher that he had, Nancy Fraser Coco. She came to me and said, he's got talent, he needs to continue. Please bring him back. Bring him back as old as you can. When I first met Mr. McIntyre, uh, his grandfather, he was very interested in supporting um, Michael in all of his endeavors and his interests. But he was able to understand how this gift um, really needed to be supported, and he was he inquired at length how could he support his grandson in his gift in the arts. And of course, here at the BB School of Art, we have many opportunities. And his grandfather, Mr. McIntyre, has availed himself of every single one. First started, I wasn't that experienced with art, so I wasn't really that familiar with it. But after time passed, I started to really get into it. But when I did this, there was a contest, and I was really doubtful when I entered it, and everybody was coming to look at it. But after the day ended, I felt pretty good because people kept uh, commenting on my picture. And then the next day, they told me if that was the winner of it. I first met Michael when he was eight years old in the end of my classroom, and it was apparent from the very first moment how very gifted he is in fine art. Um, I understand that Michael's considering his career in, in the arts, and particularly in animation. I would so encourage him. He has the talent, the dedication, and the inquiring wonder of fine art, and he expresses that in all